hello. Today we're in a rather noisy Starbeck and we're going to have a look at uh, Mitchell's Butchers which is behind us and this review is at the request of two viewers. So thanks very much to Scott Spur and John Brown for suggesting I have a look in this Butchers. So just up from the, uh, the level crossing Mitchell's Butchers, a bit of a locals butcher I think. According to the sign outside it serves lamb, beef, pork, burgers and sausage which sounds about right. The rest of Starbeck I don't know what's happened to that, that's a funny old shop there that's now closed. That looks very decent. So just for, for clarification, Mitchell's Butchers sells Vokes' pies. Vokes' pies are made at Wixley, which is about halfway between Harrogate and York. I'll be honest, it's never been my absolute favourite pie, Vokes', but I've got to say this one looks very tasty indeed. So let's do the weigh in. A 144 grams, which is I think mid table. Cost of the pie £1.55. Okay, so let's see how it cuts. Ooh. There we go. I think it's fair to say, certainly cured pork, um, jelly, bit of jelly, not a massive amount of jelly there. Single hole at the top to pour the jelly in. Nature of the meat looks fairly ground, fairly small pieces. Elizabeth's favourite of that type that is ready, so she should really like this one. Okay, so Elizabeth, you're going to have a look at this. Mm -hmm. So, hundred I think it was was 144 grams. £1.55. So I've cut it. And uh, are you going to do this with or without salad cream? Salad cream. Salad cream, right. Yeah. Oh, getting myself a plate. Posh, posh, that's it. So here we go. Salad cream on. Good. And then, so this is Mitchell's Butchers, and it's been suggested by Scott and John that we try this. So, hang on. And so. Vokes's pies, and here we go. So Elizabeth, have a have a little little go at this. And so remember, do you remember what Kendall's is like? Yep. So do you feel you're able to compare it with Kendall's? Uh huh. I I made the point. This was quite ground meat. Mm. That's usually your favourite type, isn't it? So. Mm. That's uh. What, what's your first impressions? Very nice. Very nice, okay. So I'll leave that for Elizabeth. And I got, as I said, I've not, never been a massive fan of Oaks' pies. But you do see them an awful lot in the Harrogate area. So there we go, so. Mmm. Mmm. It's nice. Mm. Nice pie. The, 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 the meat is nicely seasoned in that. Mm. Um, appears a little bit more mass produced, maybe. What do you think? I can't tell whether it's mass produced or not. Mm. I think it's good. Mm. My view is that it doesn't beat Kendall's. What's your view, Elizabeth? I agree. Mm. So Kendall's still reigning champ. So that means that Kendall's is the champion of Harrogate. That's the last of the pies now. So we'll press move on. Should we give Borough Bridge a bit of an outing next? Yeah. No. Maybe so move on to sausage rolls. Maybe move on to sausage rolls. Yeah. <laughs> Very good. So <laughs> sausage rolls, maybe. Maybe Borough Bridge. Mm -hmm. That's the end of the of the uh, pork pie wars for Harrogate. Mm. We'll see you again soon. And please, uh, if you've enjoyed this, please subscribe. Mm. Please hit like. Lots and lots of uh, of suggestions, please, for other other butchers to try. So that's the end. For now, thank you very much.